Hey guys and welcome to part 2 of my London haul. This is my everything else video. I already did a haul video of all the makeup I got and if you want to see that I will put in a little link for you guys. Uh, and this is basically everything else. I'm just going to try to show you real quickly even though I am a babbler to the max. So we're going to try to go through this video quickly and I don't have a ton actually. The first place I went was Topshop, and I got some new jeans. These are my all-time favorite, favorite, um, like, cheaper jeans. These are the Lee. This is the Lee model, like this. And this is a super, super, super stretchy, high-waist skinny jean. It says, super soft ankle grazer. Love, love, love these. I always have to pick up a new pair. They don't last for ages, but at 38 pounds, you can't really complain, can you? Super soft, super comfortable, most comfortable jeans on the planet. I always get these, love, love, love. Higher waist skinny jeans can be super tough to find. If you are a bigger girl like me, high waist jeans are the, definitely the most Flattering. The next place we went was a shopping stable. I got a big bag. Victoria's Secret. Yay! They opened there. They have two stores in the UK, two or three. Luckily, I love going there. I have to go every time, every time I visit the US. Go to Victoria's Secret. Always pick up some cute things, even though their bra sizes are way, way, way. Way, way, way too small for me, but still, I got a new Christmas pajamas in my family. Like me, Sam, and Edward, we have a tradition where we get a new pajama every Christmas. Sam got his for Father's Day about a month ago. Eddie got. Oh, I'm gonna show you Eddie's Christmas pajamas. My mom got them for me for him and John Lewis. I'm gonna do a picture on Instagram. You have to see it. It is. Desirable. So I got this from Victoria's Secret. They didn't have a huge color selection in store. Maybe like, maybe half or a third maybe from what they have online. So I decided to go for this one. I think it's cute. It's pink. It's my favorite color. It doesn't match my hair, but it's not like I'm going to go out in this pajamas. And it's so soft. This is... The Dreamer Flannel PJs. Perfect for winter. And when I bought a pajama, I got a cami for free. I just went with the pink one because it was one of the few colors I had in my size. So if you're buying a PJ online and in store, you should check out if they still have this offer and you can get a free cami. And I got some underwear. I'm just going to show you because they are the most comfortable underwear in the world. Look like this, they're from pink. They have this little ruching on the side. They're super low cut. If you're like me, you have a big belly and you have that problem when you pull up your underwear and it kind of rolls underneath your belly fat. Go for these because they are super low cut and super comfortable and I think you will love them. So I got five, of course. Not that you really want to see my underwear, but I think it's a good tip for the bigger girls out there. And of course, being a gigantic shower gel freak, of course I had to get one of their uh, body washes. This is the Coconut Passion. Ooh, I love everything that smells coconut. Hate the taste. Love the smell. So this is a vanilla and coconut and it smells amazing. Mm, it smells like vanilla and coconut. And these are kind of pricey in the UK. They're a lot pricier than in the US, just so you know. So I just got the one. This kind of smells like spring and summer to me. But still delicious. Vanilla is good all year round, right? Oh, so excited. I'm gonna buy a ton the next time I'm in the US, I swear. And oh, the next place I went was. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. I went and got something that I have wanted for years and years and years. I went to Juicy Couture and, oh no, the box is open. Oh. 
I got myself a charm bracelet, which is loose in the box. I've wanted a juicy charm bracelet, charm bracelet for I don't know how many years. And this is what it looks like. It's gold and has a little sparkly star on it. Oh, I'm just so happy I finally got them. This is like... This is like my Christmas present to me. Like everything else I got isn't. That doesn't make any, any, any sense. But this is like my very, very special treat. I did also get some more jewelry. Jewelry. I went to Swarovski, Swarovski, and got some earrings. Cause you know I just had my ears pierced. I don't have any earrings. Last time I had my ears with just like regular piercing, I was like 18, and I really didn't like earrings. So I got a beautiful little everyday pair. And they just look like this little stud rhinestone earring, super beautiful, works with anything. I can't wait to switch out my the stupid nasty ass ring nasty ass rings I'm wearing right now and put in these. And I also went to oh, the heavy one. Selfridges, you already know I went there and I got myself a nice big candle. Yay! Scented candles are a must during the winter season and this is my all-time favorite candle. And it's from Voluspa. I don't know if that's the correct pronunciation, but you can read, right? Uh, and this is the San Crisp Champagne. And let me see. Sparkling brewed champagne mingles, mingles with hints of vanilla and barrel oak. Vintage Vallispa. And this is one of their more most popular scents. And I got the, I think this is the biggest size. Oh, and it just smells so good. Mmm, just coming out of the box. It's a big, beautiful black glass. So beautiful, smells amazing. And this is quite pricey, but I think this has like, it doesn't say, but I think I read somewhere it has like 90 hours of burn time. This is a 12 ounce candle. So this does go a long way, even though it is quite pricey. And, oh, the most important thing, I did get, I got some shoes for my wedding. Oh, this was like half the reason to go to London right now. And I went to Christian Louboutin, prettiest shoes in the world, you all know that. Very expensive shoes, but when I fir first heard about Christian Louboutin, saw his shoes maybe like 10 years ago when I was a, just a little, little teenager, I thought there is no way in hell I'm gonna afford those shoes. But for my wedding, I am gonna splurge and get some. And of course, even though I already have a pair of Christian Louboutins, I still had to get one for my wedding. Yay, so let me show you. These came out this summer and it was love at first sight. But I did not think that I would find these in stores because I thought these would be super popular. They will sell out immediately. So I didn't go to the store with a plan on which shoes I would get. I just I thought I, I knew I would go into the store and I would find something I would love because his shoes are amazing. Never, never ever did I dream that I would find these. And they're so beautiful and they look like this. Oh, so sparkly. And these are the Socate 120 millimeter glitter mini mini in the color grenadine. So this is, it's like, you can probably see it's a silver color, but it has like purpley and greenish glitters as well. So sparkly. 
and I got these and not because Christian Louboutin does do a Christmas and a, a bridal line bridal shoes basically white but I for this price the Louboutins cost I did not want to get a pair that I would only use once so I got these which I will love 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 forever so beautiful and not, not only are they perfect for my wedding but they are perfect for my honeymoon we are going to Vegas and these are sparkly beautiful Vegas shoes so 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 pretty I'm so 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 in love I still have to get some gel pads though because they are about half a size too big but they only have full sizes they didn't have any halves in 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 the smaller sizes, this is a 36, I should probably have 35 and a half, but I have wide, disgusting man feet, so, but I do get in these. I just need the, the little gel pads and they will be perfect. And are you just, oh, I don't want to ask you if, if you're jealous, because that would be super mean, but I mean, what is not to love? Oh, so pretty. So when the time comes for our wedding and in January, I'm, I'm going to show you about a million pictures, of course. Oh. And now that you've seen all these super exciting things, you've seen the shoes and you're like, okay, I'm ready. Whatever, that's what I came for. But I did get two books at the, at the airport as well. And since the reading is important, I want to show you it's important to read book, books not just watch movies because you use your imagination and it is important to use your noggin and not just watch and sit there like a zombie so I got two books because I had buy one get one half off so I got Lindsay Cog I Heart Christmas she's one of my favorite authors of all time she buy, she writes the most fun and adorable chick lit books and this is maybe like the sixth, fifth or sixth book in the I Heart series. I'm super excited about that. Gonna start reading that tonight probably. And I got Dan Brown Inferno. Because it was, I, I got one of them for half off. So I thought, why not buy two? Because this has been on my wish list since it came out. And. You know, everyone's seen the Da Vinci Code, but reading it is much more exciting. And I read that years ago and loved it. So it's time to read Inferno. And it's a big one. So I will have some books for maybe like a couple of months. This will last me because I don't read a lot every day. So that's it, I think. I think I've show you, shown you everything now. I did get some Christmas uh, baubles from Fortnum and Mason and I do I'll do a Christmas uh, picture post on my blog we're getting a treat today so that should be super fun decorating it and I'll show you everything and I'll show you new, my new beautiful baubles that hopefully I haven't unpacked them yet but hopefully they're still in one or I guess two pieces and not a thousand so that's it. I really hope you enjoyed watching the part two of my haul. As you can see, I have bought a disgusting amount of things in basically four days or three because the first day was only travel. So in three days, I have spent disgusting amounts of money and bought crazy amount of things. But that's what I like to do. I like to haul on... I save my money for months and months and months and then I go on holiday and I just buy everything. I want not everything, but you get it. It's just me. It's just me just being Kaya. So we're going to wrap this video all up because I see I've already been filming for 14 disgusting minutes. And that's what it's like when I babble about my things. So thank you for watching. Give it a thumbs up because... I hope you liked it, remember to subscribe, all that stuff, and I will see you in a little while, and you know, Merry Christmas, so bye!